Hi, I'm Natalie Pavlin and welcome to my YouTube channel, Marketing Like Natalie. So in this video, I'm going to be discussing what risks should you consider when undertaking an audit of your organisation. It is really important to audit your organisation's marketing and internal capabilities to keep ahead of the curve. So what are the five risk factors that you should be looking out for? Number one is analysis paralysis. Do not become bogged down with analysing the environment that you do not move on to the planning stage. Factors will be ever evolving, especially within the digital realm, so it's best to analyse, act and reap the rewards now. Number two is that the marketing environment is complex, so seek the relevant materials for your organisation. Prioritise sources of information, whether that is internal or external. Be accurate. Make sure that all the sources and analysis is representative for your purpose, whether that is analysing the consumer or the market. Number four is to be active, not reactive, to auditing your business so as to not miss any opportunities. Number five is the interpretation risk. Schumacher and Day identify three risks in analysis. These are filtering, distorted interference and bolstering. All in all, managers may look for evidence that fits their own views of the external environment, that sustains their beliefs and supports their views. Therefore, in order to mitigate these risks, follow these four simple steps. Define your current markets for the organisation and the customer segments within these. Number two, assess what value your segmented customers want. Number three, define how and if the competitors are meeting their needs. And four, combine all of these first three steps in findings to determine whether the market or segment is attractive to remain or enter into. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Marketing at Natalie. Thank you.